All right, today's video, we're gonna talk about how to instantly add more club head speed, right? We all have that hole in our course where it just takes that bomb to get us down there, get us a little closer to the green. This video is gonna help you get in that instant club head speed with one simple little idea. Mike Granado with Athletic Motion Golf, my good buddy, our speed producer today, Sean Webb. So if you haven't already done so, make sure to subscribe, enter some comments down below. We're giving away free swag, free swag, every week to the best comment, but you gotta be a subscriber to win. Sean, how can golfers add more speed instantly to their golf swing? Swing harder. <laughs> or no. swing faster. Swing fast, that's a good point. Swing faster, so, you know, to me, um, the easiest way to get more club head speed and ultimately ball speed if you're hitting it solid because that's really all that matters right mm -hmm. ball speed in the end but if you want to get your club head speed up you need to figure out how to get your arms moving faster right now we're not talking about like a six month program where you get your body in shape and exercise and stretch and all that those things are fantastic we're talking about out on the golf course right now right now instantly gain more speed and it's you've got to move the club faster and the best way to do that with the body you have right now watching this video is to make the arms move faster because they're holding the club absolutely and you know it's it's easy to say just make the arms move faster you know we have a lot of videos on how to position the body and get the pressure in the right, right. place in order to speed up the arms what i see a lot in golf lessons golfers have been taught that you need to take the arms out of the swing. Right. You know, lock the arms down with a towel, use the swing shirt, whatever it is. They, you tell them to use their arms and they think it's taboo, but if you want to get this club moving faster, it takes speed in the arms in order to do it. That's right. Yeah, the body is going to move pretty darn slow. Yep. So again, we're talking about that next tee box. We want to move faster. We want to hit that par five and two. We need to pick up the arm speed pick up all that stuff and it's going to get the club head moving faster yeah and, and um, we, we talk about it all the time that you know golfers get to the top and they're trying to leave their arms there and fire their body they think yeah. that's magically going to help but I, I think I heard this from a, a golf instructor named Tony Luzak he made a comment he said there's no magic muscle that connects from your hips to your club head and what he means by that is just because you do this there's no muscle that stretches to the head and makes it fire out really That's fast right. it does not work like the that. the only thing connecting to that club is your hands and arms so you got to get them moving faster now obviously you need a good grip and sure. we're, we're, we're making some assumptions that sure. you've got some good things in place before we teach you this but in essence if you can get your body position and think nothing but getting your arms to go as fast as possible you're going to pick up club heads almost overtaking the body Absolutely, Almost, especially with the driver, because what a great feeling to swing my arms past me, because right. that's going to shallow things out and allow me maybe to uh, hit up or very neutral. A little inside out. Instead yeah. of down on the ball. Again, we're this is instant. This is that turbo boost in the speed. So we hit a couple drives, or you hit a couple drives, about 114 mile an hour club head yeah. speed, right? We're going to put you on your knees with the only thought of swinging your arms faster because we're going to take away all of that rotation all the, of the pelvis shifting. especially I'll, I'll yeah. be able to make some trunk but right most of what i'm feeling is okay what do i got to do to get the arms moving as right. fast as i possibly can so we're really going to limit the things that can produce speed so let me give this a shot this is only the second I'm gonna, time i'm going to actually back up a little bit i would go that way a little <laughs> if i get a toe ball here you're going to get hit go right over okay there. all right so i'm in place let me give it a shot here go as fast as i can with my arms Hit it solid. Club head speed of 103. 103 on my knees. On your knees. And the only thought was? Get my arms swinging as fast as possible. So for those of you that think that this, firing this as hard as you can, it may position you in a way to get the arms going faster, but I don't know what that is uh, percentage wise, but I'm up in the near <laughs> top percentage of my club head speed right. with my knees on the ground, inability to really uh, rotate hard, I guess so I would So if we put you on your feet, add all those extra sources for speed and power that we all like to use, getting more open and all that, you probably weren't that open hitting no, that swing. Let's look at that. You know, it was happening so fast. There's my back swing, zero hip turn, but a little bit. Yeah, maybe 10 degrees. A little bit, and then sling my arms past, and I would say I have a pretty tight uh, hip flexor on the right, right here, so I'm not able to move much. So most of this is trunk, but firing the arms past me in that manner allowed me to get 
103 compared to 114, that's that's up that's in the pretty higher good. ranges. So you can definitely add club head speed. Again, this is not a six month deal. All those things are fantastic. We encourage everyone to do, improve their body to swing faster. But instantly, you got that next par five you want to get on it to, it's been your nemesis hole. Think about moving the arms faster. Let all the other stuff happen. Move the arms faster. That's going to send the club head faster. That gets you farther down the fairway. Get you close and hit the par five and two, make your birdie, take your buddy's money. Everybody's happy. There you go.